yourself right by the little uh, building and we will stabilize it from my uh, 10 foot kayak here and we'll build a PVC pipe and those bumpers uh, that go inside the boats that we're going to build today. Three foot two inches give you six inches on both sides for your floaty on either side there and now what we're gonna do is um, I got these little holders here I'm gonna take this screw off and put one underneath under there and then I drilled a hole put one screw there and same way on the other side and then once I did that put a screw up top there and on the side to hold them both in place on both sides. And after that, we gotta glue the PCs together, to this to there, there's a glue there, and that's what we're gonna do now. shop because it's raining outside so now we got our, uh, our piping across here across the whole kayak here and got the two angles on these are the gonna be the stabilizers there um, all there's is bumpers off of the boat and they got two holes in it one there and one down here and what it's gonna have it's gonna look like this right here and the pipe gonna come right down here and fold on to these holes so now we're gonna mark the middle I already marked one here and that way we can get the middle of that and what I normally do what we'll probably do here is uh, probably put that high that way uh, it's got enough on the bottom here so the kayak can go down in the water and it's not too much tension on here so now we got to cut a piece that runs down here and we've got our uh, our T fitting here that goes right here and then across here and then down with uh, these elbows here and uh, I got our end caps that what we're gonna do is put holes in here then I got some uh, some bolts that I'm gonna put it in through there and then I'm just gonna bolt it on to that so that's what I'm gonna do right now through there drill a hole through the cap here and then just put a bolt right there it's nothing much to it and there's already holes in this thing here so you don't have to worry about drilling it you got drilling this end cap right here so and then I just did on both sides and what I do now is I'll glue the these two here and I'll just pop it up and that's your stabilizer there stabilizer here for my kayak my sun dolphin 10 foot kayak here um, here's the left side here's the right side it's pretty it's sturdy so it will hold it I believe and so I'll tell you the um, measurements here this one here is just uh, three inches right here that goes from here to right here and this is just a, a end cap I use an inch and a half piping and then uh, this elbow here and this arm right here is about eight inches on both sides and then this piece here is five inches and i believe this piece this long piece that runs across there is three foot two inches 
and put it right in the middle. And uh, I'll turn this thing around. Same way with uh, this, three inches on both sides, eight inches on both sides, uh, five inches here, and then uh, three foot, two inches. And, uh, some people use a uh, 45 degree that comes down and straight down. I like this, it's out further more. And then I might, what I might do right now, later on, um, I might cut this down and um, put these um, put these uh, T's there right here and uh, just like that either in the middle or right there work perfect too just because uh, for the rod holder I know I got two I got one here one there but that would never hurt two or or I could put uh, another pipe that goes up further then I could put a GoPro mount on top or do whatever you want to right there so that's what completes my uh, kayak. I know there's a lot of people that don't don't uh, don't have this on YouTube. So I figure, well, well I'm gonna build mine because I know I'm gonna use it this weekend to go. I'm actually gonna go crabbing in it. Me and uh, my uncle Gary, we're gonna go crabbing in it and stuff like that. And so we're gonna have a lot of fun. And once I'm out in the water, I'll post a video on it. And I'll put it at the end of this video here and uh, keep you updated. Alright guys, so now we're outside. I just completed my uh, kayak stabilizer. There's the finished product there. Here's a stabilizer. Almost touched the ground, but not quite because when you sit down, the water will come up on the kayak there. And so I put these uh, little rod holders here and there. And then I know I got two, well, one there, one there. So I got four, whatever I want to do. Here's how it looks there. And the piping is actually not that expensive. I probably with the uh, with the glue and all the piping and the stuff, elbows and tees and bends, whatever. I probably spent twenty, thirty dollars on everything, if that. And the time, maybe if I would just kept on going, maybe an hour or so. Something. Uh, like we're that. out here testing uh, my uh, stabilizers out in our backyard pond, and uh, it's a whole lot better Way now. Better. lot better what do you think about gary well, i mean it makes it a lot better it's just light you don't it's not affecting the way you can paddle and everything you got the fishing rod holders in the back yeah. when you get off you can stand up in it yeah you can stand up in it with this let me push you off a little bit more stable than it was had any questions uh put the comments down below and uh make sure you subscribe and like this video